Hey guys, may I still play Enchante yet again? Shall we resume my location? I use a controller now, so I gotta remember that. Okay, so, we just went to this cave. It's like right at the beginning of water entrance place, and there's a demonic bat creature thing, perhaps? I'm not entirely sure. Man, the window's pretty small. But that's okay, I am commenting about window size because it is, uh... An important thing for me to mention here. Oh, I guess I can crawl into a gap here. Is this some kind of dungeon? Or just some random cave that may have some... Oh, oh, we're in the forest again. The forest of where I get killed by random creatures. Is this a different place? Well, there's a, a demon dude up there who I'm not sure if I can even kill, so let's just move on from there. I do have monkey ability, so if I ever want to climb somewhere, it should be doable. And I can get up here. Where there's little bat guys. I can't jump on people, I think, so I'm not gonna try. Jumping on enemies doesn't seem like... What, what the heck? Did someone get angry? Okay, he can ground pound sometimes. Okay, I get it. So is, is this a different map than the one from earlier, or is this the same forest area? I'm not entirely sure. It doesn't look familiar, but then again, these overworld places generally don't really look familiar to me at all. They, they all look kind of the same, it seems to me. Okay, so just jumping through the woods, looking at the background, and opening in the woods, seeing the ambient tracks propelling themselves throughout your music director's house. Okay, I guess I can go through more logs here. So yeah, this is different. Just sort of a cave that leads to another cave that leads to another forest and then another cave with more bats. Hello little cute bat. Oh, let's <laughs> you tried to bite me with your little teethies, but it didn't work because you were, you know, distance is a thing. What are you? You have hair. Ah! <laughs> Beware creatures that get freaking angry when you're seen in their sights. Words. Okay, yeah, let's just continue onwards. Where, where am I going with all of this? Am I going to more forest activities? Okay, if you say so, and then I can get upwards. I guess I want to go higher and higher and then fall and then higher and then higher and then fall. No, we'll not fall this time. This time I'm inside of a thing and it didn't kill me at first at least, at first. Where is this going? I guess I'll just keep ascending and ascending before I get tired. I guess I'll dance here. Everyone needs to see Shantae's dance. It's a, like a lifetime changing experience. Ah, okay, so uh, spiders do not like to see her dance. So now I know that. So all is well. All right, so I think that guy actually shot me there. So let's climb and see what I can find here. Um, questionable nothingness. Okay, so have I missed something crucial? What, what's the point of coming here if there's no anything? I get the feeling I have missed something crucial. Hmm, let's take a gander around. Maybe if I jump off and do a running leap or something, can I go up here? No, not really. Okay. Oh no! Don't fall down! Run over here and then there's dudes abound. But I can climb up here, but what's the point of this place? It's just ambient woods and that's about it. Dang it, what the heck is the point? Is it here that I want to go? No? There's... Huh. What is this place for? Did I miss the point somewhere along the line? Um, maybe stumps are important or something, and later I'll find that out. I don't know. Hmm. Well, if there's nothing here, then I guess I'll just head on back to Calendar Town and see what we can do there. Woo! Run away! Almost to the town, right? Almost? There we go. Okay. Time to head into town again and see what I can find this time. Warp squids is what I want to do. Let's see. Warp squid house. Save room. Not yet. Bath house. Not necessary. Firefly shrine. Nope. 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 Well, I do want to go to the item shop soon, but here at the warp squids hut. Where there's a mother squid of warps. Do you want your children there? Yes, I have. Er, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, you've got like a million babies. You're welcome there! Oh, yeah, they have more babies for you? 
Yes, I have four for you. I, I, I think what's gonna happen is you've got an electrical socket over there and that you're going to plug yourself in and activate some kind of netherworld portal. Um, yeah, this is your final baby. Yay! Ooh, something very useful. What is this usefulness that you are going to teach me? Whoa! A special dance that I have no idea how I'm going to replicate ever. Uh... Oh, okay, so that's for warping. Okay, so I need to dance if I want to warp? What if I do it now? Wait, what was the dance? That's kind of hard to remember, actually. Uh, down, up, right, left, B, A. Okay. Okay, let's see if I can do this. Down, up, right, left, B, A. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Okay, so that does work. Awesomeness. Okay, so now let's uh, go to the item shop, I guess, and buy an upgrade to my abilities. There's fireflies there. They are not necessary, however, for victory, so I will not partake in them necessarily. Okay, lady, it's time for me to purchase your fine wares. If you would please let me see them. Um, boot. That is indeed what I want, I think. So let's buy it. And forget, like, I didn't even look to see how to use it. Double tap up for a two-hit spin kick. Awesome. Oh, I know that's... Yeah, okay, that's... That's... Let me out! Let me get out of here! Let me escape! Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So, double tap up for some kind of crazy roundhouse spin kick. I see. Okay. <laughs> so now I can attack aerial enemies. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, what else? What else? I don't think Bolo's useful. There's the gates. Save room. That should be nice. I think I should heal up at the fountain, too. I actually have no idea where I should be going. I think I want to head uh, the opposite direction from Watertown and see where that takes me. Perhaps the Oasis? Thank you for being saved, game. Uh, I don't know how much my health was there. Let's see the in the bathhouse, and then we shall proceed. Yeah, I have, like, one health I can restore here. Thank you very much. Thank you, free bathhouse. You make it very worthwhile to live in this place. Okay, so uh, where the heck is the exit? There's Bolo's gazebo. I doubt I need to go there. Alright, Watertown Gates. It's been nice seeing you, Watertown, and now I have a free warp to get back to you whenever I want. Mwahahahaha. Although maybe I should have used that free warp for a uh, Use those warp squids for the the, the, the the first town in the game. I don't know. Maybe that would have been more beneficial to me. Maybe I should go back there? Nah. Let's just examine this rainy scape here and knock the guy into the liquid. Hey, look, a raft. Can I ride on that or something? What are you, Spectre, Spectre, Spectre? Damned Spectre! Damned Spectre! <laughs> Spin kick in your face, dude. Destroy it. Evil can always be destroyed by a roundhouse kick to the face. It is a law of nature. Hey, you there. I can go through these? Oh, I kind of didn't think so. Give me health and stuff. I desire that above all else. Hoo Bingo Spumoni. Die! Dang it, dang it, dang it! Get out of here! Man, enemies are getting kind of tough when you don't know what the hell you're doing. Um, I could probably climb up there or something. Let's check it out. Uh, or let's get hurt instead down right let's -a go don't hit me with your stuff sting it ah, freaking why why ah, well I can sort of not really oh I actually needed it here well I'll be darned uh, can I please not die by this guy nope I have to die by that guy awesome pretty good this game pretty dang good dang monkey has like more momentum, I think, is my problem, and I'm getting confused. I think that's what's going on here. Yeah, whoa, okay. I'm pretty bad at using that. The world is changing in ways that I could not even imagine. Dang it! Friggin' I am bad at dealing with these enemies for some reason. Just perish? Oh, I, I do get to keep my items. Ooh, Firefly! Hooray! That's my first one. That was like an easy one to get, though. How come none of the rest of them were easy to get? Dang it! I want easy Firefly so I can look at the scroll and probably get another dance move, perhaps. Okay, I need to get back up here. Hopefully not die by the, the freaking ghoul that lives at the top of the mountain here, but 
he was there and he does not mess around. Ah, get out of here, get out of here, get out. Uh, can I whack you with my hair? Oh, it doesn't look like he can go like lower. So you know what I'm gonna do? Roundhouse kick! Oh, what? No. Don't, you can't do that to me. Ouch, okay, I guess you can. And accidentally using my items. Awesome. So I guess kicking him might not be the best plan of action. Dang it. Give me health. No! I need sustenance in order to survive. I'm afraid of these little hairy chubs here. I don't want to get mauled by them anymore. I am sick and tired of being utterly annihilated by these fools. And thus I shall transform myself into a monkey and ascend the heavens here. Ascending the heavens. Uh, anything? Oh, it doesn't look like there would be unless it's the world... Nope, there's a ceiling there. Hmm, it makes me wonder if the other place I went in the forest that was mysterious also continued because it did not have a ceiling. Uh, don't attack. Now where are you, you little cretin? Right there! Okay. Alive and well, at least for now. Uh, I could go up there. Ooh, a rock floating in the water? How does that make any sense? I have no idea. I guess rocks are made of pumice here. All of them. All can float. Oh, of course there's an enemy right up there, not a secret. Uh, dang it, this is harder. Alright, so last time I went up here and got killed by that guy, so this time, uh, I guess I'm not gonna go up there since I don't want to get killed by that guy, but I do wanna, I do wanna make sure I clear out most of the enemies here. Dang it, why, <laughs> I wish enemies would, like, pause while you're dancing or something, it would make things a lot easier, I guess. How many hits do you take? Okay, so my kicking upward kick does like 1.5 damage or something. Something like that. It does 1.5 times more than the normal hair whip is my guess at the moment. Where? There's land here. Thank you for appearing land and fences. Well, thank you, fences. You're not very protective for as far as falling into pits is concerned, but whatever. Whatever floats your cow or, or boat or water here. Um, you are dead. This place is a place, and there is not much to it, although it is already over. Okay, and what do we encounter now? Uh-oh, we're getting into the rocky world where there are plants and what the hell things. <gasps> ah! Okay, that's a snail, I think. Oh my goodness, snail, I can whack you. Eh. Good night, snail, I can safely hit you from here. So if you would please be vanquished. Uh, Goodbye! Oh, so that, those snails have those same patterns that I saw from earlier. Do I have to destroy all the snails if I'm going to proceed? I guess it's something I can try at least. Whack you in the mouth! Eat my hair! It's delicious! It's delicious! Uh, hair is evil when it is. Uh, what are you? Okay. Well, look at him waxed up. He's pretty cute. Or she. No, those are not boobs. Those are like shoulder blades. <laughs> <laughs> Getting confused with the anatomy of strange creatures? Is it really that surprising? Whoa! Okay, so if I duck, I can avoid, like, everything from you, and then I can sort of whack you and then lose my health. That seems like the thing that usually happens in this world. Okay, the darkness now is getting a bit creepy. Like, I noticed this in the last area. The music gets all weird and scary now when at nighttime rises. It's like the demons themselves were coming to party and were giving me some kind of social event trauma. I don't know. Uh, whoa. Oh, I can climb there. It's worth a shot, I guess. Dance, baby, dance. And now let us ascend. Aha, there is probably perhaps a thing here, but what's further. I guess I can... Ooh, I can go inside this lobster shell. No, I cannot. It's just there for decoration. Okay. Ooh, Firefly! Yes! I have no idea what I unlock for this, but it's gotta be something good. You just know it. Alright, monkey. Yeah, monkey... You can't stop monkey's momentum by stopping pressing the button, so... It's kind of scary. They actually control quite different. It's... It makes an interesting thing. Monkey can climb, but monkey's jumping ability is a little bit more impaired in terms of stopping. Interesting balance. Oh wait, do snails like not appear at night or not for the monkey or, or something like that? Is there anything above here? Doesn't look like it. But there is almost dooming. Almost dooming. I guess I want to kill you or just run like hell. 
Run I kill sounds like a good plan. Maybe I should kill you with fire. Oops. Oh wait, wrong buttons. Dang it, I'm pretty bad at figuring out my buttons here. Ah, what am I doing? Just, you know, getting myself killed. There we go. Explode that guy, even though it was completely unnecessary. And I'm almost out of fireballs now. Probably should re-equip myself at the nearest shop. Uh-oh. Get it into Forest World Swamplands. I see. I think we're probably almost to the next town by now. Considering there's... Last time there was three. What the heck? Ah, zombies! Okay, they don't die. Necessarily. You gotta hit them in their parts. Oh, wait, what? I don't know, actually. Maybe zombies don't die and I should just avoid them. It didn't really look like their bodies were taking damage there. I am afraid. Zombies are not something I am usually encounter. Maybe, yeah, they don't think they can actually take damage. They just lose their heads and walk around aimlessly. Dang it! I am not affiliated with the undead. I'm a genie. I'm not quite sure what I'm affiliated with. Some kind of ancestral spirits, perhaps? Ooh, this looks like a special place. But it's not a place I can go at. It's locked, apparently. That's probably the next dungeon. Maybe. I guess we'll see in due time. Whoa! Okay, zombies are green during the day. Man, zombies shouldn't even appear at all during the day. I know the sun is their arch nemesis. If they touch the sun, they will get a save prompt. I think I should probably end up the part here. And see you guys next time when I guess we continue going through this swampy forest, encountering more of the undead. Hopefully not. They they frighten me. I am afraid of creatures crawling through their graves upwards, striking through the soil and into the broad daylight, where they cower in fear as the light breaks through their chest and destroys their hearts. See you guys next time.